Oh, no, no, we're not doing that today. That's for another time. I forgot, that sounds like fun, doesn't it? <laughs> I haven't gone caving in such a long time. But hey, everyone, welcome back to... Uh, oh, I think I got it. Oh, I think I closed the fence gate. <laughs> welcome back to another Let's Play episode. This is Dallas. We're on episode 166, and um, today we're working on Mesa Road. Mesa Road is a project I've been anticipating for a long time because it just seems like fun. I like making roads and s like stuff like that. I don't know why. <laughs> like all this pathway throughout our base, I, I really like it for some reason. And considering I can make one all the way to uh, the Mesa Bomb, and this is also good for uh, the future world downloads for people to know where to go and whatnot. But here it is, Spud and Buster are waiting for me. I need a bed. Luckily, I grabbed some wool. That's not how you do it. There we go. I wonder if color beds are coming soon. They're probably going to come after the 1.1 update, most likely. Well, I don't even know about that. <laughs> well, maybe. Yeah. Wow, we are getting so caught up to PC, if you think about it. Anyway, um, okay, so I got some sugar... Wait. Oh, I had sugar cane here. Yeah, so this map wall right here, this is going to be for, obviously, um, to cover the Mesa Road. To kind of show you where it goes. How do you make maps again? Is it just, like, the full deal? Yeah, so there's seven... We need nine. There we go. So I'll come unlock these later. And as of right now, we are going to go work on it. Um, Spud, do you want to come? Of course you do. <laughs> We're going to take Spud and Buster. I'm going to set them up at the building site. Come on, guys. This shouldn't take long. I'm not going to build the bridges today, I don't believe. I think I'm just... Spud, don't do it. Spud, don't do it. Gosh dang it. <laughs> I still can't believe they didn't fix that bug. Um, but let me show you where it goes so far. Most of you guys have seen this. Uh, no, actually, I think I've changed it a little bit. So it kind of circles around here. Uh-oh. Mobs. Those are from the Wither fight. They're still out there. Jesus. I think they should automatically despawn. They should not stay in chunks like this. Oh, my. But, I mean, Buster, take care of them. <laughs> um, so, yeah, we're going to be redoing that bridge in the future over there. And we're going to be needing to make a bridge right over here. And this is where we're working today. I got, I did that a little bit while ago. Um, Spud, you can stay right here. Buster, you can stay right there. Um, yeah, so we're going to need to make a bridge right here, and it's going to kind of come to a spot where it's going to, like, have a kind of a curved staircase. It's going to be kind of hard to make. It kind of goes up right around here, and this is where I stop. So this is where we're continuing today. i got to make the road all the way to the Mesa Biome. I'm just going to kind of eyeball it. <laughs> I don't really know exactly which way I need to. I just need to go straight that way. So I'm going to get to work, and I'll update you guys here in a little bit. All right, guys, I've been long at work on this road. As you can see, that's where we left those guys to give you an idea of where we're at. And this is the circle thing, stair thing I need to mess with. <laughs> I'm going to have a hard time with that. Um, but I didn't get it all the way done. I'm just updating you guys because I still got that straight long path to go through that big, like, planes bomb, if you know what I'm talking about. But this is what I got done so far. I kind of like it. And by the way, just to mention, this is not going to be the final product. I'm going to be adding lots of detail into it um, using different blocks. It's not just going to stay all this. Um, even though I do kind of like it like this, but we don't travel on this road too much, so we need to make it look like it's overgrown and stuff like that. But yeah, it comes right around here. I actually really like this part, how it kind of came out, because we have a really steep part right here, and I didn't know what to do with it. Oh, there's a cave. This is why I want my adventure log so bad. If you don't know what that is, <laughs> um, it's a book I would always carry on my person, and I mark down, like, everything I find. And if I find a cave I like, I'd like to mark it down. And if we had coordinates, that'd be nice, too. Um, so we can come back and explore it one day. But no, we don't. 
Um, anyway, it comes up this way. You know what? I've realized that Minecraft is a lot like real life because I had to cut down so many trees. And in real life, they have to, like, cut down so many trees just to make highways and stuff. It's insane. <laughs> but I really like this area. It has nice scenery. You got some nice flowers over here and whatnot. Um, and then it comes out to the Big Plains Bomb, if you know where this is. This is really near spawn. There's our track over there. Kind of circles around this way. I like these little oas oasis. Is that how you would say multiple oasis? <laughs> um, over here. We might do stuff with that to like make it pretty. Put a lot of flowers around it, even though there already is. Put some fences around it for like safety. And then it comes over to this part. We're going to have to make a tiny bridge here. Whoop. And here we are. <laughs> oh, I'm always hungry. I hate carrots, man. They're just not a good food source. If you don't know where we are at, home is obviously way back that way. There's our track, and this is the part, this is the biome, the plains that I was actually wanting to build in at very first. And it wouldn't have been a much difference because we're kind of in one right now. And that's our um, spawn right back in that corner, right on a mushroom. And straight this way is the Mesa biome. So I gotta make a lot. Oh, where's my sword? Huh, I can't die out here, man. Look how many levels I freaking have. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna continue working. I'm kind of curious what's over this hill. Oh, that's the direction we actually went. We came straight out of here and went straight that way when we first spawned. Hey, buddy. All right, it is finally finished, Spud. Can you jump this? There you go. This is where we stopped last time, and I continued on this way. Wow, that took way longer than I thought for some reason. Um, but I only used two diamond shovels, so and one was already halfway broken. Um, oh, this would be a good place to find some horses, maybe. I see some spawn out here sometimes. But yeah, anyway, the next thing um, is I'm going to be going through here and probably roughing it up a bit. I mean, it looks good now. I might even keep it like this. I'm not for sure, but I don't want to alter it too much. I might come through and add maybe some stone in it and whatnot here and there, like rocks. Um, but lighting as well. I need to figure out a way to light it up. These are transparent blocks. I could put lighting under it, but that would look kind of unrealistic. Just random light coming out of nowhere. Oh, I like this. <laughs> it looks like it goes across a train track. I might want to put some like cobble under that and then here we are at the Mesa I might come through and put some fence posts down and put torches on top of it every so often I think that'll be a nice little thing to do and it goes down here Spud you're so slow <laughs> and then right up here and then there's a pig in my minecart and here we are so I think that's how I'm going to end it there um, I'm going to stop working on this project now because I'm honestly sick and tired of uh, pathing dirt I guess that's what you call it do you want to get out, bud? You feel like... No, you're staying. All right. Well, I'm going to head back home now. I think I'm going to mess with the map wall because... I'll, uh, hmm. I might have to expand the map wall because this is quite a long distance. We'll see what we can do. Okay. So, um, I kind of figured it out. I don't think I'm going to be able to get all maps. Just... Okay. There's one map created. Let's see where that puts us. Right here. Oh, gosh. So, that's going to go like... Oh, yeah, so we're going to have to expand these, like, quite a bit. Oh, boy. <laughs> I'm okay with that, though. Wait, can I do it like... Oh, wait. Can you do it like that? Oh, you can. Or does that duplicate it? Oh, no, it it makes it further out. Yeah, yeah, right. Oh, that went the wrong way, though. No. Oh, wait, so I need to go... <laughs> I'm so, like, confused right now for some reason. I need to go over this way and create a new one. But how far is it? I can't really tell. There's, like, a little pond. I'm... I I'm sure this is far enough. Was that far enough? Indeed. Awesome. All right, let's go expand this one. I think that'll do a little better. Put that in there. Go around and... Yeah. Okay, yeah. So that's what I want. I'm going to ride Spud and kind of unlock these maps. And then I'll show you what I come up with afterwards. Okay, well, this kind of sucks. <laughs> Not really, though. Um, actually, it kind of goes to the center. But as you can see, the road like goes right on the edge of other maps. And I was going to unlock all this anyway, so it doesn't really suck. Um, 
See, I don't know how I'm going to fit my home in here. I don't think I'll be able to. I guess you'll just have to know that it starts down here. Like, this is my home right here. It didn't line up with that one for some reason. Oh, wait, I need to go up one above. Oh, maybe I... No. If I wanted to fit my home in here, I'd have to make it one more wide, which I don't really want to do. <laughs> so I got that one, that one, and then I think the Mesa Bound will uh, pop up in this one, like, and then it'll be right around in this area. So I got all this to explore. Yippee. I'm so excited. No, not really. It'll be fun, though. All right, which one of your horses wants some slimy butt cheeks on your back? Don't look at me like that. <laughs> no. Uh, Spud is too slow, man. He's just a little too slow. And I'm not dealing with that. That's supposed to be Spud stall. Remember Admiral? Oh, boy. All right, I'm going to grab some saddles. I just want a normal horse to run around on because I got a lot to unlock on the maps. And Spud's just taking his time. And that's not nice. Where's all my saddles? Oh. Wow, you're actually good. Look at his hearts. I don't really care about jumps a whole lot because every horse I've ever found on here has awful jumps for some reason. <laughs> He's actually good. Wow. You look like a butterscotch too. Should I name him Butterscotch and keep him? Nope. I need my brown horse. And his name's going to be Roach. <laughs> I'm telling you, that is my dream horse. A lot of you still don't know why I want a brown horse. I mean, a lot of you do, but a lot of you always ask, why do you want a brown horse? It's your dream horse. It's because... If you didn't know, I'm a huge fan of the series The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. It's the greatest game ever made, in my opinion. Go give it a try. Literally, give it a try. It won over 800 awards, probably even more than that. Um, like, that's a record for video game. More than Skyrim. That's how good of a game it is. Uh, but go check it out. They're actually um, coming out with a Netflix series, and you have no idea how excited I was for that. Am I getting off topic? Yeah. Um, but in the game, uh, Geralt of Rivia has a, horse, a, brown, a full brown horse... And he calls it Roach, and I don't know why. I, I was just always like, I always liked that. <laughs> so I've always wanted to do it on here, and I still have not got... Well, I have. I have actually got a full brown horse, and it was a baby. Horse, go my way, please. And, uh, well, I grew it up, and I accidentally killed it. You can go snoop through episodes to see <laughs> where that happened. <laughs> but it's not what it looks like. Listen, you're just too slow, Okay. You're slow in the head and slow on your feet. No. <laughs> uh, I got this one, though. Oh, wow. Wrong area. Oh, wow. Yeah, definitely. Oh, wait. Hey, kind of. You can kind of see the... This is basically all we need right here is where the road goes. Yeah, we don't even need all the... Yeah, we do. It looks stupid like that. So, oh, this is going to be fun. Um, This is kind of like the desert. You can kind of see the desert peaking right there. That's going to be like the deserty area. This is going to be part of that birch forest in the desert. And this is all spawn right here. Oh, wait. No, that's spawn. Look, right there. That's my spawn mushroom. Right there. And then there was a tree right here. I walked off and cut it down, and we walked this way. What? No. Whoops. And then we went just... We went on down that way. <laughs> and then we kind of circled around, and we found the Mesa Biome. And then we walked around this way. We did like a giant loop, and then we ended up here. Yeah, that's kind of what happened. All right, I'm going to unlock all of them now without updating you guys and just finish it. All right? Let's go. Spud, don't be jealous. There's that beautiful sunset I like seeing. What was that? Oh, hi. I'm Dallas. What's your name? You could grow up to be, uh, what are you? Ow, now you're hurting me. <laughs> what is it? Ah! What is, guys, stop it! <laughs> Just wait a minute. We can work this out. Um, but yeah, I got the maps done. Um, actually not all of them because I had a change of plans. Let me go show you real quick. Um, this is the last one right here. You can actually see a lot of the mesa in this one. You can see the road at the very... Uh-oh. My bad if my voice get... Or, hang on. Yeah, I had to cut it to get here because every time I approach my house, it starts getting really laggy because it loads in all the stuff I have. And I've noticed in my past few videos, you hear, like, voice... Like, my voice audio go crazy and stuff like that. Only when my game lags. I guess that... I don't know. I guess it just messes it up. But that's going to go there. That is completed. I actually decided I'm not going to do those three, not just because I don't want to, but it doesn't make sense because the road goes perfectly through this. So actually, we can get rid of all of this, and I think I want to lift this up a bit and put some fences under it to make it look stand at eye level. So I'm going to go do that real quick. And voila! I actually love this. It turned out perfect. <laughs> like, having the little stand down here, it, it looks way better without those extra three maps that I would have put on there. 
Um, so yeah, our home is just a little cut out here, and then you, this road goes all the way, as you can see, to the Mesa biome. So it's perfect. I'm actually starting to grow in these maps a little bit more too. I like the old maps because they're more vibrant, and I like lots of color on the maps. But this one's kind of nice because you can kind of see trees a little bit better. In the old one, you couldn't really see trees too well. Um, yeah, that's, isn't that kind of cool right there? <laughs> I noticed it's like a perfect cutout. I didn't even do that for my spawn area. I spawned on that brown mushroom right there, and it's just like a perfect cutout. We're going to have to build something there sometime, just like to, you know, memorate our spawn area. But that is it for today. I'm actually going to, come on, Buster. Spud, you can stay here and watch the map for now because we're not done with the project yet. We still got bridges um and we got we need to light up the road a bit and uh, what else just spice it up <laughs> that's about all 90 percent i'd say just need a few wooden bridges no 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 more like 85 <laughs> percent because it took out all the torches to place and whatnot there we go can't wait to start knocking these signs off this wall it's gonna be such a great feeling all right so now that we got basically that done for today um, I'm going to mainly do these ones in between episodes, by the way, because, I mean, and there's no reason not to, because it's just me pathing dirt. That's all I'm doing. <laughs> Same as the desert road. Um, but the next one I've been wanting to do, it's not even on the project wall right now. Um, actually, right now, we're going to go mess with a few things, such as enchanting. We got 65 levels still. I was going to save up to try to get 100 and go on one of the biggest enchanting sprees ever. Which I'm still going to do, but I want to go ahead and enchant something real quick. Um, because as of right now, I'm running around with an iron sword, and it's not good. <laughs> um, now, where is... Oh, I got it on me. There we go. Okay, so I got that. That is going to be... you. That's not even going to be our sword to fight the wither. This is going to be the sword to get wither heads. So that's going to... Once we make our armory, we can go put that in there. Um, oh, I need silk touch. Oh, it's almost broken, too. But I need a sword for around the house. And this sword, I want looting 3, fire aspect 2, and sharpness. That's all. Because the reason I want that is um, I'm always running around and needing food. And it sucks. As you can see, I just killed a cow and I get this. And I want to be able to just get, you know, cooked food out of it. I don't want to have to run to my house and cook the food. It's quite easy. And I need a sharpness just to deal with mobs, really. Um... So we're going to go do that real quick, Enchanted Diamond Sword, and I think I have some books we can throw on it to actually build the book we, or the sword we want. Do I have any diamonds in there? Oh, I do! I got diamond ore! Awesome! <laughs> Alright, let's go down to the enchantment room, or spawner. Oh no! Oh wait, yeah. Let's go all the way down here. I'm still kind of iffy about this. I don't know if I want that. Oh yeah, but here's this other map wall to give reference. That road starts right there, goes all the way through here. Oh, wow, I actually now realize my spawn is actually cut out of this map. Huh. Yeah, tell me guys what you like down below better. The new map style or this greener one? I don't even know if I want to update this one. Okay, hey. You're still here. Hey. Hey. <laughs> oh, man, that's funny. Okay, so, um, right now, I've already checked my... Oh, gosh, where's my... Oh, there it is. I was down here just a second ago. I made a sword, and I checked it, and it was a smite four. So, yeah, no thank you. I'm going to enchant a book, I guess, just to get this out of the way. Level three book? Ugh. No, just a, a level one, just to get that out of the way. Bait it. Pfft, get the... Ugh. I hate terrible enchants, man. I hate it. Protection one. Awesome. I'll use that for the future. Bane. Oh, my gosh. Stop it. Ugh. Get that out of here. Give me something good for once in my life. I deserve this. That's okay. That's decent. I hate this game with a passion, guys. <laughs> Gosh, dang it, man. Um, we're already down to 59. <sighs> Thing is, um, I wanted to save up as many levels as possible. Do I have any good ones in here? Okay, well, I, that's okay because I can actually use that enchant for our uh, home sword. I want sharpness for... I don't really want sharpness five. I don't need it. Uh, flame or fire spec two and looting three. Do I? Oh, I got a sharpness two book. Um, oh, I got fire aspect. I might take that. 
Yeah, I don't know. There's not much else. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to build this sword in between episodes or something because it's gonna take some time. It's gonna take away a lot of my levels too. I actually wanted to try to reach level 100 so we can go on the biggest enchanting spree ever, but I don't know. I'll decide what to do. <laughs> and what I have decided to do is I am going to wait until I get uh, around 100 levels. I don't know if I'm actually going to be able to reach 100 levels because that's going to take a long time. But in between this episode and the next, I'm going to spend as much time as I can AFK down at my uh, zombie farm or my XP farm while I do other stuff. Uh, so hopefully I can reach that. So I'm not going to worry about enchanting that sword this episode. Um, but that Unbreaking 3 sword I just got, that will be useful towards my, I guess you, I can call home sword. Just uh, sharpness, looting, and fire aspect so I can get cooked food and kill mobs easily. So what I'm going to do now, actually, is as you know, we do have um, this one guy up here. You know what guy I'm talking about? Probably not. <gasps> Eight! Yay, it's still working. I love that. <laughs> All right. Hey, guys, I'm back. You guys like your prison? Hope you enjoy your stay. Where are you? Oh, some new babies. Awesome. Is it you? Most likely not. You have Lurth. Hey, that's actually not bad. It's this guy. What was that? Fire sp Oh. I actually need that for my new sword. It's 25 emeralds. Okay, I, that might be useful. I might try to trade these guys in between episodes as well. This right here. I want that so bad for our new uh, pick we're going to make. Be yeah. You know what? Why not? I oh, good. I have books on me. Yay! Here we go. Efficiency 5. That was a lot of emeralds. Jeez. <laughs> I'm so happy I got it now. Oh, yay. Um, what was the other guys? Okay, that... Oh, that's one of them. Protection 2. That's decent, I guess. Efficiency 2. Not so good. Okay. All right. And this guy... Uh, it was nothing. Okay. <laughs> um, actually, I could start trading with these guys some more. Yeah, I'm going to go grab a lot of rotten flesh. Let's start getting our emeralds back up. Okay, I just traded with this guy like crazy as you just saw and I, I would just like spam click this button and shift to get all of it in there and trade him, which was good and then I'd come over here and unlock, uh, I mean trade him one of these to unlock it again, but I don't know, he's not unlocking it this time. Does that mean it's like permanently disabled or do you have to like trade a lot, a lot of stuff to get that trade back? Because I have been, I traded some of that, I got some, I traded some lapis and I got traded some redstone. And I'm done with him. <laughs> so, yeah. I don't think there's really any other ones over here that I'm worried about right now. Just some farm. Hey, Iron Golem. You ready to burn? <laughs> yeah, I'm done with that for now. Okay, I got up a little further than I thought, I guess. <laughs> yeah, so that's what I'm going to be doing all the time in between this episode and the next. Um, as you see, even when you're up this high of levels, when I get, and I still even got some zombies standing here, um, but yeah, it kind of gets you up about two levels, I'd say. Sometimes one when you start reaching 70s, I think. Yeah, I'm going to try my best to get to 100. I, no, I guarantee you I probably won't, but I'm going to try my best. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here anyway. I don't really got much else I want to do today. Um, it's been a while since I gave a code away. Would you guys like a code? I have so many to give away. The only reason I kind of don't really get, want, well I want to, but the reason I haven't really been giving that many codes away on my videos, because I have a lot of codes to give away, is because that I don't know if anyone grabs them. Because everyone could possibly think maybe that someone's already grabbed it so they didn't grab it. I don't know. How many of you guys actually go check to see if someone's taken it? Because I want to make sure they get taken. <laughs> um, so I don't know which card I'm going to put on the screen now. Um, it might be from the latest one or it might be from the Greek mythology or the Chinese mythology. I'm not for sure. I still got some Fallout mashup packs too, but I'm going to put it up on the screen right now at the top. And whoever grabs that, congratulations. Leave down below if you got it because I want to know <laughs> um, who got it. And... I might pin your tweet. Who knows? Um, 
Did I say tweet? I mean comment. Yeah. Oh, time for the comment question of the day. I need to get out of this armor. <laughs> oh, I don't like, I don't know why. I just don't like wearing armor around my base. Only boots. Diamond boots that are OP as heck. Anyway, today's comment question of the day comes from a random YouTube channel. I couldn't fit it all in there because we don't have booking quills yet. Give me booking quills, dang it. <laughs> I want them so bad. It's driving me insane. Oh, you guys would, like, that was a question, actually. I forgot your name. I was about to pick it for this episode, I think. Uh, someone asked what I rather want. Armor stains or book and quills first? Which is a very good question because I want both. Those are the most, those are the two things I want most in this game right now. More than a woodland mansion even. No, I don't know about that. But you know what I mean. Like, I want them so bad. But honestly, I'd probably pick book and quill because I like my adventure log and everything. But that's not the question. This question is, are you planning to raid an Oshu mine anytime soon? Um, yes. But <laughs> the thing is about that, that's why I picked this comment, is I'm waiting to do any adventuring until 1.1 update because that's the last thing I need to be doing is loading even more chunks um, before that update comes out because it's the freaking Explorer update. It's the adventure update. <laughs> and that's the last thing I need to do is unlock, like I said, more chunks before we go find Low Woodland Mansion because if we don't unlock any more chunks, there's a better chance of... Um, the car cartographer that will breed in there giving us a woodland mansion I can't talk today giving us a woodland mansion somewhere closer so yeah that's what I'm kind of waiting for um, but once the 1.1 update comes out guys get ready for some exploring because oh boy we're gonna bring Buster with us we might bring Spud I don't know I'm kind of thinking about that if I should bring them or not because Spud will help me carry more it's gonna be a long adventure probably longer than the jungle adventure our jungle adventure lasted two or three episodes where we went to find a jungle and we did end up finding it that was a fun adventure that was our last adventure we did other than that we have kind of stayed at home ever since um, so yeah hope you guys enjoyed today's episode and um, yeah like I, I hope I answered that question I'm not gonna find any ocean monuments until then Look at him staring at the sunset. Isn't it beautiful? Oh, wow. That looks nice. Well, guys, thank you for watching. Whoa, where'd the sunset go? Oh, I guess <laughs> that's backwards. Did you see that? It's like it switched. That was weird. It didn't show the sun. Anyway. <laughs> Buster, say goodbye. He really likes that sunset, doesn't he? Well, it's not there anymore. <laughs> he disappeared for a second. Did you see that? He's gone. He's there. He's gone. He's there. You're still okay. <laughs> yeah. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye.